Well, we've had a little bit of a couple of crazy days in our household. Bill spent yesterday all day in the ER. Um, thankfully, everything worked out and he is home now. But so, you know, I thought to de-stress, what I would do is while he's in the house, all good resting, is head out to the place that is my happy place. And if you are not new here, you know that's the Dollar Tree. Hey, everybody, it shall be with a chick plus three. Welcome. So I thought, hey, if the Dollar Tree is my happy place to go and you are here watching Dollar Tree content, it must be your happy place too. So I thought that I will take you along with me. So let's go shopping at the Dollar Tree. What do you say? Let's go. Right off the bat, inside the door, brand new signs. And I love how these have a little burlap banner. It gives it dimension. And look at this adorable towel. The only downside is it's microfiber. All right, a wall of bows. Let's see, I love my window cling. Look at that, featuring gnomes and some cute snowmen and snowflake that you can use well after Christmas. And you get two sheets in each of these packages. Now look at these boxes. This is a brand new Dollar Tree find for me. It is shaped like a giant gift tag, guys, but it is a box, a top and a bottom. So not like a flip top, a true, box where the top comes off of the bottom so picture two separate pieces I mean really different and fun an icicle fringe this is like so vintagey I think for a banner but see here look here's a closer look aren't these the coolest I was kind of so excited like where do I look next Lots of fun garland. You cannot beat the prices. All right, now this is new. I have never seen a floral like pine cone embellishment in the center of a bow at the Dollar Tree. Way to go, Dollar Tree, stepping up your game. And I'm glad to see the crushed velvet bows are back in the jewel tones of plum and red. All right, and you know I like my candy. Look at this. I mean, if you cannot find a flavor candy cane that you do not like at the Dollar Tree, then I'm afraid you're plum out of luck. All right, I have never heard of a Jello candy cane. Does that ever look tasty? And the Palmer peanut butter cups. My family happens to be a fan of those. And the expiration dates on all of this Dollar Tree candy is well out there. So you certainly can purchase it now for the upcoming holidays um, and put it away. Now these are really cool, fun Fetty candy canes. Another candy cane flavor brand that I myself have never seen. So I was really excited. And the chocolate hot cocoa bombs are back. These little Swiss Miss Milk chocolate packs. And what is this? This is brand new, Cold Stone Creamery. That's one of those expensive fancy ice cream places. Well, they made giant candy canes. How fun is that? And more Swiss Miss hot cocoa, but that one has marshmallows. And look at all these adorable boxes. These look like the perfect size to hold a large candy bar. <laughs> and just some of the fun little, I call them like doodads, Christmas, just the little odds and ends Christmas things. 
want to scout out if there is anything different that I haven't shown you guys this year so far. These are back out. Now these designs, I'll tell you, are not printed on the actual plastic. It's kind of like a wrap, almost like a decal. So they're a little bit different. But this year they did print the lids and I don't think last year there was any design on the lids. All right, I always check out the toy aisle for stocking stuffers, toys for tots, gifts. These 3D dinosaur puzzles were pretty darn cool. And look at on an end cap, I came around the corner and I saw some more new signs mixed in with some that they had in another spot in the store. But hey, that's what makes it fun. You come around the corner, you never know what you're going to see. These are really nice. And the wording on these is like a galvanized piece, like glued on there. That is one massive bag, but really cute. Always a good selection of gift bags at the Dollar Tree, as the same goes for the wrapping paper. Again, if you can't find a print, I don't know. And do you want to be Santa Claus? Here's your beard and white eyebrows. And new blind bags. Oh, it's been a little bit since I've come across some new blind bags. Wishkin's Puppy fantasy. I think I'd like this as much as the grands. And look at this, Fab Five. You get five little mini toys in one bag. Granted, they are teeny tiny, so definitely for ages three and up at least, but sweet. And this is name brand Slinky, guys, not a knockoff. These are two little real Slinkies. I thought that looked fun. More blind bags. They've had the troll blind bags in the past. This is just, I think, a different um, series. The same with this My Little Pony. And again, I could feel the little toys inside of those were quite small. And they have some of the craft fabric strips back in stock. And lots of beads. I haven't seen these in a while. They've made an appearance again, the black canvases. So it's nice to see those. You could do some really nice like reverse painting for the holidays. And I purchased these printed canvases last year for my grands to paint and give away as gifts. Well, they've got out these new designs this year. So certainly everybody could use a second painting by a kiddo, right? So good idea again this year. And speaking of painting, here we go. I passed on this one. I saw it a couple weeks ago. I was very happy to find it again. And I have never seen this in the live before. Oh, I love this wreath form with the wooden beads. You could use it just as it is, but definitely something you would see at Target for a minimum of $3. And I wanted to show you this. You know, I love my pine glow. Look at that, a whopping 69% more. They had both size bottles there together. So you could get the 20% more or the 69% more. And hot hands, if you got to spend any time out in the cold, those work wonderfully. And it is a pack of 10. And I thought I would check out the freezer section. That's something new, chicken lo mein. And my store is well stocked again with another little end strip of these little travel bags. Perfect if you are hitting the road. And look at this little portable screwdriver. I wasn't sure if I shared this with you guys before. We have one. We really like it. So I wanted to show you these. And it is the time of year that I love these self-adhesive hooks. So I needed to pick me up some of those. Thank you, Monique, for sharing your 
fabulous Halloween and Thanksgiving decor with us all. I so appreciate it. And Bill and I will be back tomorrow with a Dollar Tree haul. So I hope you'll all be back too. And remember, my friends, until then, please be well.